Communication Arts recently completed installation of electronic media projects for the 95th Bomb Group's new memorial room, located at the Pima Air and Space Museum in Tucson, Arizona. The project consists of a variety of displays, ranging from video loops to full interactive large screen resources designed to tell the story of these World War II veterans. The electronic displays were designed to augment text information, as well as provide a way for visitors who were not wishing to read, an easy way to see and hear the story. A very impressive and well-received display is the personnel roster, which contains a database-driven resource of all of the personnel who served with the 95th Bomb Group in World War II. Users can search for a name, a mission, a crew, or even an aircraft and receive descriptions and data, plus a wealth of photos that can be moved, turned, and even enlarged. Several levels of information make this resource a tremendous asset to the room. The information is updated remotely by the 95th staff by using a custom design program, so as new information becomes available, it can be displayed within moments. Another instantly updated displays shows donor names continuously scrolling. As new donors are added, this list is updated by 95th staff and can change instantly, making it timely and also a very attractive fundraising device. Another unique display created by Communication Arts is the Video Comments Collector. It uses a touchscreen interface and pulls contact information from visitors, plus allowing them to video record their reactions to the displays. The easy-to-use unit provides an on-screen keyboard and then uses a high-definition camera to record. These files are then stored on the computer and are later retrieved remotely by the 95th staff. Demographic information is then used for mailing lists and the video files can be added to the 95th website. A special feature of this custom display is the use of an actual World War II field telephone for visitors to hear their recording when they've finished. A central display of the room is the Recollections Exhibit. This is a large touchscreen that enables visitors to search for and playback oral history recordings of selected veterans. As the sound plays, vintage photos are displayed that were provided by the vetter. This is one of the sound areas that we designed using a special sound restricting panel. In the panel coverage area, sound is easily heard, but outside of it, the sound is substantially reduced. We're grateful to the 95th Bomb Group for allowing Communication Arts Multimedia the opportunity to provide the electronic displays for this important memorial room. <laughs>